Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your GoDaddy website builder and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you add an image gallery or a photo gallery into your GoDaddy website? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, a real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to add an image gallery or carousel into your GoDaddy website anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, maybe selling products through your GoDaddy website, you know that it's important to have a lot of images of your products to help with your conversion. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your GoDaddy website builder. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I already logged into my GoDaddy website builder and this is the editor. Now, first off, if you want to add a photo gallery into your website, you're going to need to choose the page you're going to add it to. So off to the right here, you can see there's four pages in this website. So you just choose the website you want to add the gallery to. So I'm going to choose this one. Okay. So once you've done that, it's going to show the page that we're working on. And then all you're going to do is just click into it. And then you're going to see these plus icons. So in order to add a photo gallery into your GoDaddy website builder, you need to add another section. So a section is going to be this, I guess this right here where it's covered in turquoise. That's one section. And then up here to the top, that's another section. And here to the bottom is another section. So when it's circled in turquoise and inside each section, you can go ahead and add these extra little features. So what you want to do is click on this add section button. Okay. Once you do that, you're going to see this menu pop up from the right and to add a photo gallery here on the left, look down here to the bottom. There's this button here called image gallery. Once you click on there, you want to go ahead and choose photo gallery. Okay. So here are the different layouts for photo galleries inside of your GoDaddy website builder. So this one is what I think of typically as a photo gallery. So your users can see all the like little thumbnail photos and they can click on it and kind of scroll through that with little arrows. But there's these other kinds of galleries. So you just choose whichever one you like. This one's kind of cool too. It doesn't have the thumbnail, but your users can just scroll through by clicking on arrows. And this one right here, it just has a static image gallery right here. So your users aren't going to be able to scroll through, but they'll see six different images right there. So as you can see, this one is an image gallery of three on top of each other. So this one takes up a lot of space. This one right here has a space so you can write in a description next to it. So yeah, you just choose whichever one you want. I'm going to go ahead and just choose this one at the top because I think this one is more typical of what people think of in a photo gallery. So you can see it just adds it right in. So that's pretty cool. So they can go ahead and just click on these arrows and scroll through, or they can click down here. Now, obviously you're not going to use these stock photos. So what you're going to do is go ahead and just click in to each photo. So we just clicked on this one and then off to the right here, you can go ahead and change the image. So just click on change image. Okay. Once you do that, you can go ahead and drag a photo in right here, or you can grab it from your desktop by clicking on here. Okay. I just grabbed two images and I just uploaded them. All right. So we're going to go ahead and choose these two right here. And then once you've chosen, click on cancel down here. All right. So we got one chosen. We're going to insert right here. All right. So now you can see that we updated that photo and you can see it right down here. And then you have to do that for each one. So there's that image. Let's say here, we'll go ahead and change out this guy right here and just do the same thing. Just click on him and then come back over here, change image and then choose another photo and then insert. Okay. So now you can see we've changed two of them. All right. Next you want to click on done. Okay. So that looks pretty good as an image gallery. Now, if you're looking at it and you don't really like the way that it looks, you can go ahead and change the layout by clicking up here layout. And you can see we have these other layouts that we saw earlier. So maybe we want to change it to this image gallery layout and you can see it just rearranges it. And then also lastly, as far as our image gallery goes, as you can see, it dropped it right down here, but maybe we need it to be up above our privacy policy here. You can just move the whole section up by hovering over the section. And once you hover over it, you're going to see this little arrow, just move it up. All right. Now you can see it's been moved up over the privacy policy. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to make an image gallery or a photo gallery, or some people call it a carousel for your GoDaddy website builder, that is the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.